and welcome back to Let's Play Pioneers of Olive Town. All right, so we have a bunch of stuff we need to go turn. Oh, that was weird. We have a bunch of stuff we need to go turn in to uh, get some town requests done. Before we head out, though, I just realized something. Our lumber is done. So that means that ooh. So now that our lumber is done, what we could do is we could actually get the bridge fixed. Hmm. Okay. Uh, this is actually kind of tempting to get the bridge fixed. Because here's the thing. It does take, I think, a day or two to get the bridge fixed from what I remember once you donate the materials. I keep saying donate. Once you turn in the materials, but... Uh, the problem is, I don't know how much we can actually do in the new area without upgrading tools. Hmm... So I could get the town request done now and- oh, wait, hold on a second, are those strawberries? No, they're just wild berries. I'll sell them anyways. But yeah, what we could do now is we could... Oh, by the way, I'm also gonna keep one of these. Uh, star potatoes are a rare variant of a crop and later on we are gonna need them, but that's not until way later. But I'm gonna play it safe for now and just keep a couple of them on me just in case. I'm also going to keep some mayonnaise in case I need to cook with it. Because I do want to cook more in this game, I've decided. Food is, you know, really helpful for restoring stamina. Like, right now we could make vegetable salad with... Potatoes and potatoes. I'm pretty sure that's called potato salad game, but okay, you do you. Actually, do we need to donate this to Love It? I keep saying donate. Do we need to turn this into Love It? Hold on a minute. Actually, I kind of want to just cook in general to unlock more recipes. I'm going to make some vegetable uh, juice with... Okay, you know what? Maybe we should get some more ingredients before just making everything with potatoes. We'll worry about that later. Okay, anyways, like I was saying... I think I'm going to do the town request first and then get the bridge upgraded. Because, yeah, even if we do repair it now, it's going to take a day to fix up. And we're going to want to upgrade tools before we do anything over there anyways. Which, now that I think about it, might be our next major purchase. Or our next major goal. Because it would be nice to get some upgrade tools uh, on me. But we'll worry about that later. For now, let's head over to Town Hall. I'm going to go turn in a few things. Is there anything else I need to do right now? I guess we could go fishing later. Oh, fishing. That's actually something I just remembered to, that I forgot to show off. There's like a little, I don't know if it's done on purpose or not, but there's kind of a little Easter egg you can do with fishing on the farm. Uh, I'll show that off once we get back. Anyways, take my lumber, cause that is by far the easiest out of those three. So take my lumber and take this raw white opal for the money. And with that, we have cash again. And I'm going to go spend that cash on seeds, because I have one empty uh, farm plot. Oh, while I'm here. Let's grab all these rewards. Ooh, iron. Ooh, actually, you know what? I really want that. Give me that. And then a bunch of metals we can sell off. Ooh, and an end table. And a full inventory. Hold on a minute. Uh, we just got our first piece of furniture. Unfortunately, from what I remember, the customization of this game is kind of limited. In that you can only put furniture in certain parts of the house. So we'll have to see where we can actually squeeze that in. Also, we have bait now if I ever want to use it, which... Mm, I don't know if I'm really going to be using too much bait early on. Right now, I'm kind of more worried about getting my uh, fishing level... Or fishing skill leveled up. Also, what is with your walk, kid? What is with your eyes, kid? You look like an... You look like an alien! Well, anyways, let's, uh, let's head home. Also, Marcos, I feel like you would like this, right? Just bait? <laughs> Alright, he likes it. Oh, there's also one other thing you can do with town medals. I don't think Laura likes them very much. I really need to actually look up what Laura likes, but... How do you feel about bronze town medals? Mm -hmm. Eh, she's okay with them. So yeah, they also make a really just neutral gift for most people. Although, from what I remember, I think Mikey loves them. Eh, well, he likes them. Whatever. 
But yeah, we could give them away if you just want something really easy to give away to people, but I just tend to sell them anyways. Alright, let's head home. Actually, no, before I head home, right, I want to buy myself uh, some more seeds. This is the wrong store. I'm used to the store right next to the stairs, but then I realize I'm in the middle section of town. Whoops. Okay. Like I was saying, I want to buy some seeds. So I can afford nothing. My inventory is full. Hold on a minute. I need to get an inventory upgrade. How much is an inventory upgrade? I think it's like 3,000 in this game. Uh, I'll go take a look once I'm done here. So, like, what can I afford for a little over a thousand gold? So, I need what? I need nine bags of seeds. I don't think I can afford turnips, but I'm pretty sure I can... Yeah, I can afford potatoes. Or radishes. Oop. You know what? Potatoes are more worth it. Just in case we need to get some more, uh, star potatoes. Also, I do want to buy furniture, like I said, but I don't have the money for it yet. Once I get more cash rolling in, we're going to buy a bunch of furniture and decorate the house a bit more. Whoops. I want to look at materials real quick. I would like some wool just so that we can make cloth, but like I said, that's not a big priority at the moment. Alright, let's head home. Actually, I'm going to take one more stop before I go home. I want to check something out real quick. How much... Actually, I want to make two stops before I go home. Uh, how much is... Actually, wait. How much is a... Or not a chicken coop. Uh, how much is it to upgrade my chicken coop? 6,000 gold. 10... That's what? Solid lumber, 10 solid lumber, 10 silver ingots, and 50 flexible grass. We can't get any of that stuff yet. Not until we fix the bridge. Also, we can't even get them anyways because we don't have upgraded tools yet. House expansion is... Okay, that's not happening anytime soon. And furniture is expensive. Got it. Actually, I do want to make another... Okay, you know what? I'm going to make a couple of stops before I go home. Uh, first stop is Lovett's house. I'm going to donate my shellfish stew. Hold on. Also, I don't know why I've not been menuing to put things away. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna donate some soup. And I'm gonna donate the salad. It's potatoes. It's literal potato salad. Alright, so what else does he want? He wants a uh, fried egg. I can make that. Because we have eggs. Curry rice might be a bit more difficult. Mala crayfish. I don't know if I can make that yet. I don't think I can, but I'll take a look. Uh, on a Shirko. Yeah, we can't make that yet, but we will eventually. All right, let's head home. I have a lot of stuff I need to put away. Oh, can we plant these this season? This season? I just remembered we had these. No, summer. All right, that's uh, not for another month then. Also, yeah, I swear, the beginning of this game is a lot more slow-paced. We're only doing, like, a day per episode at this point, but later on, once we have more stuff to do, or, like, things a bit more planned out, not have to go to town every day to grab everything, we'll have some time. I didn't mean to sell those. Whoops, give me those back. I meant to sell these. And I meant to put these away. Also, while I'm here, hold on a minute, I, why am I putting these in here? I'm gonna go stick those in my refrigerator. Also, I'm just going to keep these to cook with for now. I could sell them for the money or for the seeds, but we already have the seeds available, so meh. Also, I think the seeds from the store are usually always, like, level zero. I might be wrong in that front. Oh, right, my tools. You know what, I'll just take the tools out as I need them for now. Okay, there we go. So let me see here. We took care of our animals, everything's been planted, we like turned in everything we needed today. 
We got some new seeds planted. I think we're pretty much done with the main work. Oh, there's also one more thing I completely forgot to show off. It's not really some... I'm not really sure if this is, like, done on purpose or not, but, um... So, you know these, like, puddles that are, like, lying around the farm? Well, here's the thing. They count as water, so you can fish in them. I'm not sure if this is just, like, a weird... Ex or not exploit, but, like, a weird... Something they looked o overlooked. But, hey, we got a crayfish. Actually, wait, hold on a second. I don't think we've donated crayfish before. I think I'm gonna go to the museum tomorrow and get one donated. But yeah, I feel like this was done on purpose though, just because they had animations for it and everything. Alright, we'll go tomorrow and get those donated then. Uh, let's get my tools back out. Oh, I'm also gonna put away the bait for now. I'm not gonna be using it anytime soon. In fact, let's put away everything we don't need at the moment. And let's get this process so that we can start uh, upgrading our tools soon. Oh, that's one thing I forgot to do that I kind of wanted to do. I want to go check out how much it's going to cost to upgrade my tools. I want to say around 1,000 at the first level. But I know we're going to need, like, I think we need both lumber and iron for some tools. Also, I don't need this. But I think I'll go check that out tomorrow. So in terms of like, uh, in terms of priorities for upgrading my tools, I think, I think my main priority is the watering can and then probably the ax and the hammer after that and the sickle, just so that we can start up, uh, getting the better materials once we have the bridge fixed. Yeah, you know what? As much as I would like that bridge to be fixed, I think we're gonna wait on that. I feel like getting my tools upgraded is more important than getting the bridge fixed, like, early. Well, then again... No, you know what, no, I need upgrade tools. If I don't have upgrade tools, I can't get the new materials over there. And if I can't get the new materials, there's not really a point in getting the bridge fixed yet. Alright, we'll wait then. For now, let's get down some more trees so I can get some lumber going. Also, I want to go see if I can cook anything else once we're done here. I want to invest more into my cooking skills and get some good recipes going. Like I said, later on there's another way of getting more food more easily, but right now we're going to have to cook all of our own food. Or just go to the restaurant, which, meh. Honestly, the restaurant in this game isn't super expensive, but I would kind of prefer to cook things myself. Also, do I have lumber in here? I do have lumber in here. All right, well, we have enough lumber to fix the bridge whenever we need to. I don't have the stamina to do much else today, so let's head back inside and do some cooking. Also, I want a pet. Oh, right, table. <coughs> Can we seriously only put it in that one corner? Yeah, we can only put this in that one corner. Weird, but okay. Eh. Doesn't look terrible, but I guess I'll do for now. All right, let's uh, put a few things away. So what can I make? Oh, I can make potato salad now. With potato and cucumber. Like, actual potato salad. I'm just gonna cook everything, just to get my skill leveled up. And I'll eat it later. Okay, so potato salad, mixed soup. We can put in a potato and some royal fern. Delicious. Can I make anything else right now? Okay, I need to save an egg for tomorrow. Uh, I need to get some bread. I need to get some rice. I need to get some bread and egg. Okay, I just need to buy bread. Or make bread. Can I make bread yet? I don't think so. That might be something we just need to buy. We can make rice once we get some rice. <laughs> rice, beans, and I think that's sugar, right? Yeah, sugar. Okay, at some point I just need to go to the supermarket and buy like a bunch of basic uh, cooking staples. If we're going to be going in on cooking in this game, I should probably get the materials I need to cook with. Also, I'm going to make some vegetable juice with, like, a potato and a turnip. Because those are two vegetables you put in juice, right? 
I'm pretty sure there's no actual juice or liquid in potatoes or turnips, but we made some juice out of them. That sounds, I'm going to be honest, absolutely terrible to drink. Potato water is not something I would consider juice. But okay. Uh, what else can we make right now? We need mushrooms for a mixed salad. Hot sour soup. Pottage. Pottage. I need milk for those. Okra curry. Oh, I can make mama. Ooh, actually, you know what? Hold on a minute. I can make this immediately and then turn that in tomorrow for more materials. Perfect. But yeah, some of the ingredients you need, you can get from Love It by turning in uh, dishes. Omelette I need, was this? Egg and tomato. Egg. Oh, if I get rice, I can make curry rice. Actually, I might do that tomorrow, because I know that's another thing we need to donate to Love It. Okay, you know what? We're doing a lot for Love It tomorrow. If we're going in on cooking, we're going all in. But not tonight, though. I need sleep. Man, potatoes don't sell for very much, but we have so many of them that we still made a profit. Okay. Yes, the, those star crops sell for a lot, but like I said, I want to make What do you mean, rich farmer? I guess I sold enough at this point, but I'm going to be honest, I've spent so much time just on the verge of not having money because I keep spending all my money every time I get it. But that's fine. Alright, is there anything else I need to do right now before I head out? Not really. I need to go put a few things away into storage, but I'll do that in a minute. I kind of want to move my storage box. Kind of in a weird place right now, but eh, I'll worry about that later. Oh, lumber's done. And iron's done. Well, lumber's almost done. How much lumber do I have now? I'm going to take these into town and get some tools upgraded, but I do have enough to fix the bridge. But, eh. Like I said before, I think right now my bigger priority is getting those uh, tools upgraded. So I'm going to save them for now. Wait. Oh, cucumbers are done. Give me those. I'm going to sell these for money. Actually, before I sell them for money, I'm going to go put away a few just to save for ingredients for cooking. But after that, I'm going to go sell them for money. Also, I'm going to wait to water my crops. So I'm going to upgrade my watering can. I might as well just wait. Okay. Put this? Oh, no, not all of them. I just want a few of them away. Let's keep, like, six. We'll keep six. Okay, we're good. In fact, I'm just gonna let my chicken out right now. We'll take care of everything when we get back. I just want to go to town and, like, dump everything I don't need to make more room in my inventory. Actually, you know what? No, I can just do this. There. Yeah, I want to go see how much the uh, inventory upgrade is going to cost me. Like, two rows of inventory space sounds like a lot, but they fill up really quickly as we've already seen in one of these type of games. One of these hoard all the crafting materials type of games. Oh, right, I finished the town request. I completely forgot about that. Hi, Karina. Yeah, I think we met before, right? Because I'm pretty sure we've met everyone at this point. But yeah, now that we've finished the second town request, we have unlocked the beauty salon. So you know what that means? That means we can access all of the silly costumes from the DLC. I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be spending way too much money at the beauty salon. Just because... I don't know, I always like games that give you the option to uh, wear funny costumes. Sure, it kind of breaks the immersion a little bit, but it's funny and it's fun. That's kind of what these games are all about.
Victor, don't, don't worry about it. If she does turn you into a flower, I'll just stick you in storage somewhere. Oh, hey, Lovin. I'm gonna go see you later. Listen, Victor, you're a mayor in a Story of Seasons game. There are going to be some weird characters living in your town, okay? Listen, it could be worse. It could be Wolfio, the somewhat cursed, sentient dog costume. Where is Wolfio? I kind of wish they had brought him over. If he had been a marriage candidate from the DLC, I would have married him in a heartbeat, but no. They decide who they bring in from Trio of Towns instead. They brought in Ludus. Which, sure, he's popular, but come on, Wolfio is right there. Alright, anyways, uh, what time do you actually open? I just realized it's like not even 8 a.m. yet. Okay, you're open soon. We'll uh, go in and donate a few, or I keep saying donate. We'll go in and get some tool upgrades. I don't know why I have donations on the brain right now. I can't do that, I'm sorry. I don't have access to solid lumber yet. Also, do we have any uh, new tar rewards? Yes, yes we do. Got a little bit of extra cash coming in tomorrow, perfect. Oh yeah, I should probably turn this into a fried egg. Just to get the recipe out of my, uh, not made list. Actually, love it, are you open yet? Because I don't think you actually have hours. Yeah, you don't have hours, perfect. Okay, so. We can deliver some mala crayfish. Which gives us some more seeds. Actually, wait, are these, uh... Oh no, these aren't seeds. For some reason I thought they were seeds. Like, I saw the seed icon on and I immediately thought seed. No, they're materials we can cook with. Okay. We'll go put those away later. So what else do you want? You want a fried egg and curry rice. Okay. I can make those immediately, because we just need rice at this point for the curry rice, and then the fried egg I can make with the egg we got. Oh, I should probably have shipped these cucumbers, too. Also, I keep forgetting, I should probably go donate this crawfish, because I'm like 90% sure we haven't donated a crawfish yet. Oh, it's still too early, they're not fully open yet. I'll come back later. Listen, we're gonna fill up this museum, okay? I like it when there's, like, something where you can donate stuff towards in every game. Although, gonna be honest, I'm not a huge fan of the museum in this game. It's not, like, as aesthetically pleasing as, like, other games, like Animal Crossing. It's kind of basic. But, hey, it's there. Something else to do. Hey. Also, have we seriously not introduced ourselves to Clemens yet? I could have sworn we did. Huh. Whoops. Well, hi, Clemens. Alright, how much does it take to upgrade my back? 3,000 gold. And I... Okay, 1,000 gold per tool, but we only have the materials to upgrade one tool right now. Out of all of these, I feel like watering can would be the best for, at the moment. Ah, but axe is also really... Axe, sickle, and hammer are also really tempting. The hoe is honestly going to probably be the lowest priority for a while. Fishing rod would also be good to upgrade at some point, just so that we can fish more. Everything, it, you know what, honestly, everything would be good to upgrade except for the hoe. All right, you know what, right now we're just gonna do the watering can. And I don't have enough iron for the rest yet, so we're gonna need to go back to the mines at some point. Get some more iron going in. But yeah, I think our next priority will be the ax and the uh, hammer and the sickle. Oh, also, are you open today? Not yet. You're open in like an hour. I want to go check out the costumes we can buy and waste our money on. Not now, because I don't have money to waste, but later on, once we have the money, we can waste it. Hello. Oh, have I not donated a sparrow picture? I could have sworn I donated this. Whoops. Oh, you know what I think happened? I think I took it near the end of an episode and I just didn't remember the week after. Well, have a sparrow. Actually, you know what? No, this isn't like the mammal shelf. Let's take it over here. Hello. And then let's donate that crawfish. Crayfish. 
pretty sure it's supposed to be craw it's pronounced crawfish. I've always pronounced it crawfish. Hello. Alright, there's nothing else I can donate, right? Uh, no. Apparently chickens are not animals. Okay. Alright, let's head home then. I do have some extra cash, actually. Is there anything I need to buy? Yes, there is. I want to buy some cooking ingredients. I'm not going to buy seeds for once, because we're actually good on seeds. I don't have any empty pots right now. Oh, while well, I'm here. Let's continue experimenting with what we can give Laura. Mm -hmm. Laura, how do you feel about cucumbers? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure if she liked it or not. Yeah, I need to actually look up what she likes. And also, I need to sell these cucumbers for the money. Anyways, it's almost 10 a.m. I want to check out the beauty salon before we head back. While we're waiting, though, you are open today, right? No, you're not open till 10 either. Man, why don't businesses open early for me? Alright, it's 10 a.m. They're not fully open yet, because they're not in place at the moment. Whoops. I'll come back later. But yeah, we can come here and change up our look if we want, so we could change our hairstyle. Like, instead of this, we could use... We could go with the mohawk look. I forget, was the mohawk an option at character creation? I think it was. But it's going to cost a thousand gold to do this, so I'm not going to do it right now. But later on, if we want to change up our look a bit, I'll probably come here and change things up. Uh, what materials do I need to make the outfits, by the way? Cloth. Yeah, cloth. Oop. I need to get a cloth maker. Ooh, a straw hat would actually be really nice. I just need grass for that. Cloth, cloth. Okay, yeah, I need a lot of cloth. Yarn, we're gonna need a uh, sheep for that. Yeah, I do want to get myself a dumb hat at some point, but... Ooh, that's a top hat. What do I need for that? Smooth cloth and gray rabbit cloth. Yeah, a lot of these aren't going to be things until we get way later in the game. We could get these ones. These are all... Oh, these are all the DLC outfits. Okay. Oh, wait. They take one day each, don't they? Right. I completely forgot about that. Okay, while she's making that, let's take a look at what else is here. I mean... We gotta get all of the dumb hats, right? They make you do it one at a time, but that's fine. I'm just gonna commission all these and then pick them up tomorrow. Actually, you know what? I'll commission them off screen so that we don't have to keep going through the menu. Let's go check out what other outfits we can get right now. Yeah, obviously we can't get any of those until we get the materials, but... How about the DLC outfits? What are available for me? Farm boy outfit, farm girl outfit, min oh, the Mineral Town outfit. It's a little darker than I remember it. Hoodies. Oh, there's the dog costumes. And a Yukita. Okay. Yeah, I'll commission these off screen. Uh, what else can we grab? And no eyewear is in the DLC. Okay. All right, with that then, I think this is actually a good place. Oh, communication level up, perfect. I think this is a good place to wrap things up then. Just so that I can spend a bit of time grabbing all the outfits and getting them made for tomorrow. And then maybe after today, we'll start like changing up our look every once in a while. You know, keep things interesting. All right, but with that, I think we'll wrap things up here then, like I said. So next time on Let's Play uh, Pioneers of Olive Town, we're gonna head back and I think we're gonna see if we can get that bridge fixed. And get some more iron. And put away all this stuff. Yeah, we have a lot to do. So, till then.